Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel, My Project Ideas. Today we are going to make a Java project on survey system. Let us begin. Let us first see the requirements. You will be requiring an IDE. I will be using IntelliJ ID in this video and a Swing module to create a good looking interface. Let us now understand the working of the source code. Here is the main method. I am passing an object of rating class. Uh, this is a GUI form, so you can create one by going over here in the project package. Click on new, click on Swing UI designer and then click on GUI form. Uh, a menu will be popped up where you will specify the name of the file. Two files will be generated, the .java file for the code and the .form file for the UI. Let us look at our UI first. This is the panel. I have named it as rating panel and provided margins over here. This is a text field, this is a JTEX area, this is the button and over here you can see the J slider and uh, this over here is a J label. Uh, okay, you can uh, add these uh, through this palette which is present uh, at the right of my screen. Okay, so uh, I have named uh, this text field as text field 1, this is at the text area 1 and this j uh, slider as slider one the button is submit button okay and this j label over here is uh, uh, name as rate let's move to the java file this is my uh, class and this is an object of jframe class uh, which i have created which will be using in the constructor these fields will be automatically generated once you design the form uh, now let's move to the constructor so uh, these properties you need to add so that the screen will be visible once you run the program this uh, method it uh, terminates the program once you presses the close button on the uh, application once it runs and uh, set contained pane requires the panel j panel so we have created this panel over here and i have named it as rating panel so you need to pass it over here then this dot pack resizes the panel accordingly and uh, set location relative to is uh, set to null so that the uh, ui this uh, particular form it uh, pops up on the uh, in the center of the screen and uh, set visible needs to be set to true now these are the some properties which we have added uh, uh, for the slider so the minimum uh, value is will be 0 maximum will be 5 and uh, these are the markings uh, to show display the markings uh, uh, you need to set this to true and uh, labels are set to true and uh, major tick spacing which is 1 so the marking labels will be 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay, and uh, this uh, action listener I have added for the button. Now on pressing the button, this set of code will run. So I'm checking over here if the fields are null or not. And uh, popping the message using the show message dialog of J option pane class. And the message will be please fill name and feedback to submit. Now over here in the else block, I am uh, 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 running this query. This is the SQL and uh, building the connection first using the get connection method and passing the URL and the username and the password of the SQL. And then using this prepared statement, I am running this query insert into uh, this is the table name. Okay. And uh, to set the values, uh, this uh, over here set string. Uh, we can use this uh, to specify the values so at the first column which is name this value will be set uh, the text field one which is the uh, name okay over here name it will extract the value get text will extract the value and set it okay the column two will be for, uh, filled with this value the slider one dot get value uh, whatever the integer value is so I am converting it into string then uh, same with the text area and uh, now at the end of it 
uh, we need to update it so this method is called then popping up the message dated successfully then uh, setting these values the text field and the text area to null catching exception if there is any and uh, popping the appropriate message now i have also added the uh, mouse listener to the slider to make it dynamic okay so whenever uh, you slide it the slider so it will change the values of this uh, j label a rate was the j label which is present over here you can see okay so it value will be set uh, whenever you uh, move the slider so it will extract the value and uh, concatenated with star i have uh, done this so this will this complete uh, text will be displayed okay okay this was it um, let's run the program okay this is the ui suppose i have uh, named it as aman and uh, this is the slider okay you can see this uh, j label is filled uh, with text whenever uh, when you click on this three so three star four star five star okay and uh, let's submit it rate it successfully and the fields get null after pressing ok okay uh, so the program is working I hope you understood the working of the code. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our channel for more interesting project ideas.